And a three that pin. That was so bad. What happened, Randy? Oh, my God. Watch the lay down here. Watch how far right the ball goes. When it gets to that point there, it's really going to come off of that spot hard. There's a lot of dry boards to the right. Tommy Jones has to pick it up at the right point down the lane, or his bowling ball is going to go high. 35-foot pattern, very short compared to the 50-foot pattern we had at the end of the season. Try. I don't think champions win. Tommy won it. I'm not so sure it's the right ball change or right bowling ball that Tommy's using on that lane because it comes off of the spot. Now, I think it looks really good on the right lane, not so good on the left lane. Looks for a four-bagger. North do up 25. Really insurmountable lead, which he does. That's all she wrote, kid. Four in a row for Norm Duke, and folks, keep this in mind. Norm was very clear about this with us today before the competition. He feels if he wins the Motel 6 for all the riches, maybe, as we see what he needs to shut out Tommy Jones, just maybe that's enough for the voters, the PBA membership, to put him over the top to win Player of the Year. It would be his third Chris Schenkel Player of the Year award. Interesting storyline. So a lot on the line here, certainly, for Norm. If that's the case, he's nine, he'll take ten and the win. Norm makes the final. That man there is going to bowl for $150,000. The race is six strikes, and that's exactly what it is. The first bowler to get to six will take home the big money. Winner take all event here from Columbus. Dave, do you have $150,000 I can have? Not handy. <laughs> Man, door in a bank. <laughs> There's a 10, but it won't matter. Norm Duke will finish the job here. And for the first time in the very short lived run of the Motel 6 Roll the Riches, he will make a final. And a chance to bowl for the big money. 150K. Stay here, man. Thanks, man. Kenny. Tommy's day is done. This match is over. We'll watch him bowl the last couple of balls here. Normal advance. Still, Randy, what a season for Tommy Jones, capped off by the TLC win. Yeah, it was a great way to finish. A season that was a bit disappointing for Tommy. Got into a slump. Got a, had a neck injury that uh, got him in a little funk for a while. Worked with Del Ballard Jr., got him out of that slump, and he goes out and wins the season-ending Tournament of Champions. Tommy Jones is going to work a lot harder in the offseason to get back to that Player of the Year form. Here's a no finger no, shot. No finger ball. <laughs> Can he no it? fingers. This no. is not the skills competition. <laughs> <laughs> it's wide left. Hey, he's paying homage to Motel 6. What a year for Tommy Jones. He says he will work out in the offseason much more this year and be ready to win a second Player of the Year honor in three years. Norm Duke's thinking about one thing. The finals. At $150,000, he has made the championship round.